Hello, this is Declan. Today, I want to introduce a book called Basic Korean Vocabulary. Uh, this book is designed to study vocabularies and letters. So, as you can see on the cover, yeah, it looks really colorful, doesn't it? So, there are um, pictures and Korean words and English words and also a title. And on the below, like many other Korean studying books, this book also uh, provides audio resources and especially in two ways. One is QR code and the other way is blog address. So I, I read that um, all the audio resources are recorded by professional voice actor. So you can listen to uh, really authentic Korean um, pronunciation. So let's open up and see more about this book. So see, as you can see, all the um, contents are written in both way, English and Korea, Korean. And about this book, yeah, nearly 3,200 essential Korean words are, are covered in this book. And yeah, as we can, as we saw um, on the cover, this book also contains many pictures, which helps us to understand uh, and memorize um, each vocabularies. Also, um, yeah, each word are uh, in each words there are romanized uh, Korean. And also, um, in each word, I don't, I'm not sure whether you can see here, in blue color, yeah, there is um, romanized uh, phonetic symbols. So you can read uh, according to these symbols easily, even though you don't know about Korean much. Mm. So contents. So as you can see here, there are about chapter, seven chapters. And each chapter, there are units. So it's um, divided into different units, small units, so that you can study according to units. Yes. Well, yeah, about Republic of Korea, so basic uh, information is here. And then there is a map. So about Korean language and letter. So, um, yeah, there is explanation about Hangul and then consonants. Five, uh, nine, and five, and five, and then there are uh, there is a uh, vowels. There are vowels. So let's look at unit uh, chapter one and unit one. Greetings, introductions, and gratitude and apologies. So unit one introduction. So yeah, there there is picture. And then Korean words and Romanized um, phonetic symbols and English words. Korean words, yeah, Romanized phonetic symbol, and then English word. So it's repeated in that way. Um, see, and then turn on the next page. Yeah, there are some more words. In the next page, there is. There's no picture here, but um, it helps you to understand each word, how to be used um, in, in sentence. And then, yeah, and it, and it gives you an example how to use each word. See, some more. Another two pages. So yeah, there is main words, and then it helps you to study more of vocabulary which is related to this main word. See, almost one page. Oh, actually, it's two pa pages, and then yes, and then useful conversation. So so far, we've been you know studying about words related to um, greetings. So it. 
this conversation or dialogue uh, gave, gives you an understanding or it gives you um, an, a picture so that you can see how to be how to use each words that you studied before or you study in this chapter uh, unit sorry so there are there is, so so uh, unit two is started from here so with pictures main words and then without pictures so main words and then um, yeah sentences which is related to these main words main vocabularies again again here here and then yeah in the end useful conversation so you can uh, actually use these vocabularies in in sentences and in dialogue so as you can see, each unit starts really simple, starts really um, lightly. So you just can study and um, memorize or understand each word with pictures. And then you can actually try to um, pronounce each, each word through this um, romanized um, phonetic symbols. And then and gives you more... Um, information about each word through these pages and then you can mm, sum up what you studied through this chapter or unit through this conversation so um, each unit doesn't give you much mm, only let's see five or six pages yes and yeah it really helps you to study or uh, try because it doesn't look complicated and it looks really colorful and it's really yeah it's not boring so you can study each unit really um, yeah easily easily <coughs> And it gets more, <clears throat> it goes deeper and deeper. Then, and, and yeah, you can actually um, see how it can be used each word. So, so far, we've been uh, looked at this book called Beige Korean Vocabulary. And I hope that uh, it this video helps you to understand or gives you a glimpse of this book, and, and it's <clears throat> this video helps you to um, also okay so far we've been um, okay so far we have looked at this book cover and then inside I hope this video helps you uh, to choose uh, which Korean studying book and um, yeah it gives you a glimpse of this book as well so thank you for watching and yeah if you have any que questions or if you want to uh, know more about other Korean books then please let us know we want to we're happy to help and yeah see you next time bye bye